Friends, denizens of the internet, hello and welcome back to another exciting episode of Silent Hill 3. I am Devo, Lost Time Gaming. Thank you for joining me once again. We are stepping back into the shoes of Heather into the world of Silent Hill, which is always terrifying and nightmarish. Now, I'll, in the interest of full disclosure, I had to actually redo the beginning of this episode because, as you may remember from the ending of the last episode, I thought that I need to go back here you know, in this general area here to get some sort of gas can to take the kerosene out of this thing to put in the generator in the next room. Totally forgetting that I had already picked up a container, although it seems highly unsuitable. That's why I didn't think about it. And I'm pretty sure I tried this before and it said, no, screw you. But that being said, yeah, there we go. Put kerosene in the wine bottle because that's a lovely use of a wine bottle. Oil filled bottle, good. And now we can just go next door. Let's make sure I'm using the right doorway here. We go next door and dump this in the generator. Needless to say, uh, as I said, I restarted this episode because I didn't know that. And um, I basically went to the beginning of the sewers for no reason. I got hit a bunch of times, so I decided it would be better just to start back from the last save, which is right here. That being said, there we go. Oil. Put the oil in the coconut. Drink it all up. Okay. Give me that oil-filled oh, wine oh. bottle. Yes. Yeah, you know, you get them kerosene generators all the time. I like how... Okay, let's break down that for a second. Firstly, I picked up kerosene, right? Kerosene is obviously not oil. I mean, wait, is it? Am I stupid? I always thought kerosene was like gas, but, you know... Just kerosene-y. All right, you know what? Hold on. Let me just let me just say that I'm stupid. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm gonna withdraw my complaints. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta push buttons. Buttons would probably help. There, buttons. Buttons are good. Hoist, yes. Throw the switch. I was gonna complain that it said it's oil and it's kerosene. And... My my only complaint that I will hold on to is I don't think equipment runs on kerosene, like. I didn't know that was a thing. You know, because kerosene was basically heating because it burns slow and hot. All right, well, what, I'm glad that did whatever that did. Now we can go down the hole of doom. Thanks to that thing, all the water is finally drained out of the hole. Good. It looks like I'll be able to get down there now. If I can stand the smell, that is. Oh, Heather, just shut up and get down there. Stop complaining. <laughs> Stop whining. Okay, we're we're here now. That's that's great. I'm I'm glad we're here. Oh, it's so loud. <laughs> All right, I'm not glad we're here. I'm lying. This must be where the water gets drained out. Okay, just checking to make sure it wasn't a door. There's no secrets laying around. All right, let's get out of here. Hello? Awfully quiet in here. Like suspiciously quiet. Yeah, apparently everything's all good. Let's get up on and get out of here, Heather. Screw these sewers. They suck and they should feel bad. Well, that was a lovely cinematic shot. Now I'm worried something bad's gonna happen. You don't allow me to enjoy the environment without screwing me over a minute later. Come on, where is it? Behind this door? There's an impending screw job, I know it. Oh, this is great. I'm glad we're this way. Oh, sweet. The map still works here. Alright, well... Clearly the way to go is down, but let's go up. Just to see if they've hidden any kind of goodies or anything. No, it immediately stops. <laughs> screw you! Oh, this reminds me of the, the sewers from Silent Hill 1. Yeah, let's not go this way, because it seems like there's only one, like, a singular room down this side. So let's check this out first. No, you know what? Enough of your crap. Yeah, that's, that's about it for you. Yeah. Wow, you, you collapsed to the ground super hard. I'm just gonna, you're coming with me. Ha <laughs> ha. There we go. I was gonna say, I don't think that's supposed to do that. <laughs> Let's, uh, reload the old gun there. How's our bullets doing? 61, that's pretty solid. That's solid. I don't feel bad about using them, then. 
hopefully there's no more weirdos just hanging out here. Oh wow, that actually opened. Okay. Again, not really expecting that to open. Wow, this is a big old staircase. Tell me I, I'm actually supposed to go this way and you're screwing me out of all the items in the sewer. Wait a second, didn't we go this way already? Right? What the heck is that? You see that down there? I don't like that. It's a mannequin with like a crocodile face. Well, seems pretty quiet in here. Suspiciously quiet. We got. Ooh, hairdryer. All right. Wait, wh why did I, why did I just pick up a hairdryer? What? What? Dryer. I found it in a sort of garbage dump. Still looks usable though. <laughs> okay, Heather. That's great. The sweet ampule. Now that's a lot of garbage. Wait, where the hell did it all come from? Well, I guess this is all the stuff that gets tossed out into the sewers. Yeah, believe it or not, Heather, humanity makes, like, a large amount of trash. Like, mind-bogglingly huge. A wheelchair? Why would a wheelchair be thrown out here? I mean, that's a valid point. That's a, that's a valid question, Heather. Broken clock, this is from the sewer, too. I mean, I guess. I don't, I don't know. Why are you asking all these weird questions? Can I... Oh, oh, it, I'm just wasting my time looking around here. I better get going. Even so, it really stinks. It's going straight from my nose to my head. What does that mean? What? <laughs> Who says stuff like that? Heather, you're weird. Alright, well, we got a hairdryer. And the thing that was under the bridge is gone now. What? I, I'm still wondering why we got a hairdryer in the first place. <laughs> Not only that, but we have these suspicious steps to go back down. All of this is suspicious. All of it. Even the stuff that isn't suspicious, we're gonna call it, like, secret suspicious. Because that's how I roll. Alright, how about this? Wow, I, I didn't actually expect that to open. I heard a footstep. <laughs> Gunk pow. Who wants it? Who wants to taste the pain? Oh. oh, there's a bunch of you. There's just so many of you. Alright, um... We're looking for a door hard right or up and to the left. Alright, let's go hard right first. Woo! Nah, it's not this one. Yep, I was gonna say it's not that one. Oh, crap. Look out now, Heather. Look out. Oh, sweet. I was kind of worried that wasn't gonna work. Oh, I thought the... That the noises were leaking into here for a second. Health drink. There's nothing very interesting written on the blackboard. That's great. Thank you, Heather. Sweet. Save points. Bam. Sewer. You know, we've we've downgraded from underground passage to sewer now. That's great. The drawer is open, but it's only filled with boring documents. Nothing interesting. Oh, what's that? Danger, keep out. This was probably pasted on that door there. I can see where it fell off. Oh yeah, the, the little dark spot, yeah. Alright, well... Is this a security monitor? I can't see anything. It must be broken. Right again. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad we we're going to attempt to use the danger door. That sounds like a good idea. What's this? There are documents on the floor. They don't look like they have anything to do with me. But they've got today's date on them. That's weird. Well, I mean, you're not wrong, Heather. That is pretty weird. That being said, I guess we got to open this uh, totally not suspicious and dangerous door. Uh. Oh, good. Oh, I'm glad it's got the blood everywhere. That's That's great for me. Great. Don't you dare. Oh, you son of a... No, no! That's the bad news! Wait. Did that just kill me outright? <laughs> 
I think it did. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> okay. All right. I guess. Guess we'll just redo that then. Great. Yep. Let's let's get the cheese, man. I am. Uh, you know, that's actually kind of nice, because that was something that was in the original Silent Hill that they never really, uh, used again. I don't think that was, there was anything like that in Silent Hill 2, where you accidentally, like, killed yourself without realizing it. Alright, so the real question is, do we have an outlet here? There's an outlet here. Alright, I got, I got something for you. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how that works. Like, yeah, that's how electricity works, but like, not, not, not technically. Well, oh, it, it was just like a small, tiny tentacle, really. All right, well, that's cool, I guess. Just because I'm pretty sure, like, every ever since like the late '60s, like all hair dryers and curling irons and stuff like that, they all. uh they all have, like, fault protectors to make sure, like, you don't electrocute yourself in the bathtub or something along those lines. There's some complicated machine here. It's not on or anything. I'll leave it alone. Okay. Alright. Well, I guess we're just leaving, then. What about the other path we could have gone? Does that matter? I guess not. Oh, we're not going that way. <laughs> Nothing to be out here. The drum is in the way. There's something inside. I doubt I can move it. Really? You sure? Even the one that's sideways that you could easily roll? No? Okay. What? Whatever. <laughs> Do you, Heather? Wait, where the heck am I now? I thought I was leaving. You who lied? I didn't get to leave at all. Although, to be fair, I filled out that map section I was curious about, so I guess that's just as good. No, Heather, why? Why would you get in the water? I didn't even know you could do that. Get out of the water, Heather. What is wrong with you? I'm pretty sure much like the subway, much like the subway, we should probably not be on a lower level. Oh yeah, that's great. We got them jokes. We got them jokes. Woo! Made it. Oh, that's loud. It's incredibly loud. <laughs> uh -huh. I don't know what the stakes are, but I don't care for them in the slightest. They freak me out. It's just like a bunch of metal and blades spinning in a circle. It's creepy. I don't like it. Oh, I don't like that, whatever that was. That's probably not good either. There really isn't much in Silent Hill that is good. It's pretty much all bad. I'm trying I'm trying to think while I'm doing this. Has anything good ever happened in Silent Hill? No. Alright, something's definitely angry, I can tell you that much. Hear that, or someone's got like an impact driver, like on a planetary scale going on. Oh sweet, now are we leaving? Because I don't, I don't really care for the sewers. I, d I don't. It's just not a good place to be. It's one of those places, like, in a game, it's like, ah, oh, I don't like it, it's creepy, but in reality it would be near impossible, because stenches like that, like, the smell of the sewer would be way more than, like, a normal person can handle. I know, because my school once thought it was a good idea to take a field trip to the local sewage treatment plant, and as a bunch of high schoolers can attest, that was, uh, that was, that was not a smart idea on their part, on the, on the school's part, like, yeah, it was educational, but... Well, our class was not mature enough to do that. They should have known better. <laughs> Wait, where am I? I'm like in a weird outdoor, but not outdoors area. How does that work? Ooh, hello. Well, the save point. Don't mind if I do. Every save is a good save. Yes. Yes, more saves. There's always the concern in the back of my mind that, like, uh, ever since, like, the original Resident Evil, I believe if you saved it under X amount of times and beat the game under a certain amount of time, 
you got like the infinite rocket launcher. So now every time I play a survival horror game, I'm always worried that like saving too much is gonna screw me over somehow. Wait, hold on. I, th I thought I saw something creepy down at the end of the wall there, but no, nope, doesn't want to show it to me. Some creepy? No, no. Okay, I guess not. Health drinks are good. How's how is my health? I haven't checked it in a while. Wow, we're actually yellow. I'm gonna go ahead and pop a health drink. Yeah, give me that blue. Blue is my favorite color. Door works. That's always good. Anything under the stairs? That's classic hiding stuff. Video game hiding spot under the stairs. There are bags of cement or something piled up under the stairs. I don't particularly feel like lugging these heavy things around. I doubt I could use them anyway. Now you'd be surprised how much damage you could do. You throw a bag of unmixed cement at somebody. That'll... No, I'll kill you. <laughs> it's just my instant reaction. I'll kill you. Something on the floor. Nobody cares. Okay, lock is broken. Good. Good. I'm glad the lock's broken. That's what locks should be. They should just be broken. The third level ceiling has crumbled. For safety's sake, entry is forbidden. Door shut tight. It won't open at all. Well, considering the ceiling collapsed, I, that's probably for the best, I guess. That. Oh, it's just the third floor marker. Okay. Where am I right now? I have no idea. The fourth level floor has crumbled. For safety's sake, entry is forbidden. Well, we're, you know, we're staying in character, you know. You, you collapse third floor ceiling, fourth floor floor should be jacked up too. Great. How about the fifth floor? Is that okay? Good, because we're out of stairs at this point. I just, I just want to say we're out of stairs, so it better be. Where am I? Am I swear, if you're if you're secretly putting me in a hospital, I'm gonna be upset. To the to the bathroom. Okay, could you could you not do that while I'm playing a wash face? Nothing special about it. It's a toilet. I thought this building was still under construction, but it looks like this has been used. Really? Could you describe to me what a used toilet looks like, Heather? I'd really like to know. Lock is broken. Okay. Yeah, I get the feeling they've snuck us into a hospital somehow. An electric cord reel and a bag of cement. I can't really use either of them. What? You can't figure out a use for a spool of electrical cord? Ah, that's money. Take that to, like, a scrap place. Get some, some money for that. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, no. Where are we? That's not a hospital, but it's like a... I don't know. It's like a hobo village? And gun bullets. Good. Lots of empty bottles and cans. Looks like somebody was living here. Yeah, that's that's my thoughts exactly. I didn't even see the bullets. A, ugh, a filthy mattress. We drop it into the hole. It, what? No. No, I think you're I think you're baiting me on that one. I'll drink. Let's hold off on that till because I assume we can go see Oh no, I guess not. I was going to say, I assume we can go see what's at the bottom of the hole first. But I get the feeling it wants us to push that down the hole and then jump down the hole, you know, behind it. Alright, so let's push this mattress into the hole. Take that mattress. See you in hell. Yeah. And now, drop the mattress to use as a cushion. I should down... Okay, good. Jump on down there, Heather. Two points. Two points for the landing. Yeah. Oh, you did not do a superhero pose, though. You really... You, that's a missed opportunity. Well, everything's intact. Good. You telling me you could have fallen... You could have jumped down there without that? Like, was that an option? Some sort of weird... It's almost music going on, but it's not quite music. Nothing over here. All right. Oh, I wasn't sure if you'd actually let me through there. Now. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Okay. Guys. Uh, wait. Now there's things in here. Oh, there's things in here. Oh no. Oh no. 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 I know. I know. I was probably not supposed to come back in here. Okay. Anyway, here we go. I'm gonna go this way. Keep 
keep an eye out for anything. There we go, that was anything. I think that was an open window, I think. Yeah, I love that non-music there behind me. Oh, it's gone now. Tabletop is covered with papers. I don't see any info that might come in handy, though. Okay. It's a mannequin catalog. I guess that this is the reception area for a mannequin company. No, why are we at a mannequin factory? That sounds terrible. It's a thermal carafe. There's nothing inside. Wow, Heather, you're knowledgeable. Most people don't know what, know the term for something like that. It's called a coffee pot. All right, well, I guess we're just leaving then. Great. So it's not a hospital. It's a mannequin factory. I'm, I'm, I want to say I deserve that for complaining, but you know, I, I still, that's bad. Could you not put me in the mannequin factory? I don't appreciate that. Lock is broken. All right. Well, good. At least we're keeping up the, keeping up the lore. Lock is broken. Good. Now that red light is meaningless. Okay. That's just a fire break door. Okay. Lock is not broken. All right. Oh crap. Oh crap. Nope. Nope. It's jerky time. Jerky. No, eat the jerky. Come on. There's jerky right there. This jerky is useless. Stop it. You're way too feisty. Yeah, scarf that jerky. Okay. Ooh. A little loading screen there. I really don't think this was what I was supposed to do, but here we are anyway. Let's go up. Up in the up direction. Let's go. Lock is broken. Good. Yeah, if I thought I was confused before, oh boy. Yeah, now I'm like super mega ultra confused. Is that a vacuum? There are cleaning goods here. Not much I can do with them. Come on, use your imagination. You know how many cleaning products you can mix to create noxious chemicals or poison or just straight up lethal concoctions? There's a lot. Nothing but elevators for some reason. KMN Auto Parts, what? My, you like back in the mall? Where, where am I right now? Oh man, I am so confused. If anybody's got a map? That would be great. Woo! Duck you. There we go. I'm just trying to. Oh hi. Uh. uh no. Oh. <laughs> yeah, there you are, right? Yeah, come on, you gotta get up. You gotta get up. Okay, um... No, there's gotta be something in here I need. Why else would you... Okay, there's nothing. There's nothing. Time to go. Okay. Oh, God, why? Why? Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Okay, that's bad. There's so many of them in here. Oh, no. There's like a 0% chance I'm doing this, uh, area properly. <laughs> Else drink. Some papers on these shelves. That's it. Nothing useful. Shelf is empty. Okay. We're in some sort of auto parts store. What do we got there? Jack. All right. You know, you never, you never know when you're gonna need to lift something really heavy. I mean, not so much in like the Silent Hill world, but you know, whatever. Also, gotta make sure to keep my eye out for a map of some sort. Because this place is apparently massive. Nothing interesting on the poster. No maps, no nothing. Okay, well, that sucks for me. Take another quick, slow look around there. Yeah, I think we got everything. All right, well, back out of the hallway of doom here. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Well, that sucks for me. Ow, 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 ow. All right, um, oh yeah, the, that's the, yeah, okay. So this whole floor is useless then. I mean, we got the jack, so I assume that's why we came here in the first place. We got a jack. Hopefully there's nothing else on this floor we need. Wait, didn't this lead out into the stairwell? Oh, no, no, it does not. It leads out to here. What's this now? 
There's a guest registration notebook on the reception desk. I think I can ignore it for now. What do you mean for now? What? what? Its title is Repressor of Memories. The hell kind of title is that? I don't get this picture at all. Alright, well, nothing like the old creepy painting for no reason. Ceramic pot, not really my style. Now this is a calm, relaxing picture. Mountain. Nice and simple. Yeah, okay. There's a price written here. Let's see. 5000 Man, what a world. <laughs> You're not wrong. Looks like there was a picture here before. Only the caption's still around. Flame purifies all. Flame, huh? Well, I don't know what kind of picture used to be here. But I'm not too fond of fire. That's scary somehow. Okay, cool. Fire bad. Lock broken. Ooh, lock not broken. Oh, man. Yeah, I get the feeling that there was a map much earlier. Ooh, screwdriver. There was a map much earlier on in this area, and I just, like, walked right past it. And now I'm just, like, perma, perma screwed. Wait, is this where I came out of? Yeah, it is. Okay. So we've got a jack. We've got a jack and screwdriver. What? Oh, what? Oh, oh, mm, mm. A poster for an upcoming exhibition. Not very interesting, if you ask me. Oh, okay, well, I don't think anybody was, but you, know, you do you, Heather. You trash talk that upcoming exhibition. That'll that'll show the people that do things like that. All right, back into the hallway. Lock is broken. Wait, is this something? Gallery of Fine Arts? No, it's it's into nothing. All right, so let's check this then. Locked. Locked. Well, that sucks for me. All right, so then this area is clear? Question mark. That's probably the stairs. Yeah. So. Uh, oh wait, oh, I pushed the button, but the elevator won't come. Is it broken or something? Well, I mean, elevators in this game, in these games, usually are, Heather. I know that's pretty common. It's it's not great, but it's pretty common. Sad to say. All right, floor six. Again, end of the line. Lock is broken. All right, well, now we're heading down to see if we can go into floor two or one. We came out on the third floor, I believe. Nothing like big old creepy stairwell. Actually, as far as creepy stairwells go, this one isn't too bad. I've been I've been down worse. I've been down worse. It'll always be worse in these games. Hawk is broken. Good. Good. You know what I really want would be a map. Map would be excellent. Plenty of stuff behind the stairs, but it's all junk. Okay. Lock is broken. Wow, so... Alright. <laughs> I guess that's good. That means this whole wing should, in theory, be clear as long as I was thorough enough. Now, whether or not I've actually been thorough enough, that's another question. Because uh, there's a good chance I haven't been. <laughs> Elevator? Nope. Push the button, won't come, and... Ooh, these elevator's doors are open a little. The space is too narrow to be of any use, though. Okay. Can I, like, wedge it open or something? Oh, the... The jack. Yeah! Sweet. Okay... I did not see that jack come with a uh, with the crank handle, so I, I'm calling BS on that. <laughs> but without a map, I'm kind of forced to just go down here. That's probably not the best idea I've ever had, but... Oh, okay. The door downstairs looks open, too. No way I can get down there like this. Alright. So we do need something else. The real question is what? 
because I assume the screwdriver is not going to help us in that de endeavor. Oh, is this another shop? Looks like it. This had like a, what does that say? A storefront. Uh, uh, I can't, I can't read that last word. I'm sorry. <laughs> I cannot read that last word. Oh, I think this is where we came in. Because this should be... Yep, that is where we came in. Alright, cool. So we're we're not as hopelessly lost as I thought we were. But we hard left it through there, so we probably didn't check anything beyond that point. Okay. And I was going to say, this better be open or I'm screwed. Oh no. No, why? I don't. I don't like mannequins. Not. I'm not especially afraid of mannequins, but oh, this is the only mannequin with a head. There's something weird about the headless ones. Like they can still see me or something. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, you're not wrong, Heather. I'll. I'll gladly say it's weird. What are you looking at? The door? You're looking at the door? Why? I, I'm aware there's a door there. You're gonna remind me about that. Oh, we got stuff. No, I'll kill you. <laughs> okay, that was that had to have been a jump scare, right? And with no legs. I know it's just an inanimate object, but I'm still a little nervous. Afraid, maybe. Well, don't, because you're going to force me to be afraid. Cardboard boxes filled with arms and legs for mannequins. Good. Not going out the window, I guess. Oh, good. You're... What? <laughs> what? This this is blood. This is blood. Are you sure? Why why is there blood? Why is there blood? Okay, I'm leaving. I don't like it here. I don't like it there. Alright, well I mean that room gave us some bullets, but beyond that it really didn't help us much. Alright, so what? Now I have to go back through Back, I, I, I don't know. Uh, I think I have to climb back through the window and see if we can go to the left when we first got out into that uh, outside walkway. All right, well, we're going to have to figure that out in the next episode because that's all the time I have for this episode. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. I am Default Lost Time Gaming. This has been another anxiety-filled adventure into the world of Silent Hill 3 in the shoes of Heather. That being said, thanks for watching today. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and get subscribed. Let me know down in the comment section below what you thought about my gameplay, my commentary, or anything else in general. That being said, thanks for watching, and as usual, I'll catch you all on the flip side.